Assalamualaikum. Welcome back to my channel, guys. This is Nidha, and I'm back with another video for all of you. So, आप लोग देख सकते हैं कि मैं तैयार हूँ. So, this is the look that I am I am going to be creating in this video for all of you. आज से मैं start कर रही हूँ अपनी Eid series. I will be posting five Eid looks. Eid abhi is like almost around the corner. तो मैंने कहा कि आप लोगों के लिए अच्छी सी कुछ Eid looks मैं create कर दूँ, जो आप लोग different कपड़ों के साथ पहन सकते हैं. I ask you guys on my Insta stories कि आप लोगों के किस किस कलर के कपड़े हैं. And I got like some really good variety of clothes जो लोगों ने बताया कि उनके हैं. So this is going to be the first one, first look जो मैं आज create करने लगी हूँ. Hope you guys enjoy this. So keep watching, stay tuned, and we move on. So first of all, I'm going to be doing my eyebrows. For that, I'm taking this Anastasia Beverly Hills Deep Brow Pomade in the shade Dark Brown, and I will be applying that on my eyebrows. After that, I'm going to neaten them up and also apply this concealer on my lids, uh, which is by Color Pop in the shade Fair Neutral. Uh, next on, we're going to take this ABH palette, which is called Subculture, beautiful, highly pigmented palette, and I'm going to take the first shade, which is All Star. It's a mar deep maroon shade, and I'm going to apply it on my lids. And if you guys can see that I'm just packing on the product on my lids and not blending out anything at all. After that, I'm just going to add it a little bit into my crease as well, but I'm going inside my crease, not above my crease. After that, I'm going to do it on the other eye. Next shade we're going to take is a fudge. It's a deep brown shade. I'm going to be applying that above the All Star shade that I applied earlier, and I'm not blending anything right now. I'm just packing it on, and I will be doing that on the other eye as well. Uh, now, once that is done, I'm going to take the shade called New Wave, which is a cool toned yellow, and I'm just going to apply it above the shade that I applied earlier, which was fudge, and slowly, slowly start. You know, blending it out as well, and in circular motions. And again, I'm going to be repeating the whole thing on the other eye as well. Lastly, I'm going to take this shade called Edge, and I'm going to blend out or smoke out the whole look so that you know everything looks well blended. This is a more warm toned uh, yellow. And after that, I'm just going to go in with that All Star again and deepen my crease a little bit more. And once all of this is done, I'm going to take this shade called Rowdy, and I'm just going to apply it like a liner uh, above my waterline. You guys can see like a wing. Then I'm taking this beautiful shade called Electric, and I'm applying it in my inner corner of the eye. You guys can see how beautiful that looks. Stunning. I love this shade. Next, we're going to take this Bad Gal Bang Mascara by Benefit Cosmetics and apply it on both of our eyes on the lashes. After that, we're taking this handmade by Love and Care Organic Kajal, and I'm going to be applying it in the waterline, uh, on the bottom waterline and above one as well. Uh, next, we're going to go on to our face. And first of all, I'm going to be taking this Holy Grail Elixir, which is a moisturizer by Saffron Natural. I'm going to be applying it all over my face. Then I'm taking this uh, sunscreen by the Clinic Lahore, and I'm going to be applying this as well on my face and blending it all out with my fingers. After that, I'm going to be taking this primer, which is my absolute favorite by Purify by Amna. It's the Pore Fade Primer. Then we're taking this color correcting palette by Glam Girls, and I'm applying this on the areas that I have discoloration. Then I'm going to leave it to set for a couple of seconds. Then I'm taking this Rimmel Lasting Matte Foundation, and along with that, the Bourjois Foundation, which is the Healthy Mix Foundation. And I'm going to mix them both uh, and apply them. And first of all, I'm going to be blending them out. Not really blending, but spreading them out using a brush and after that i'm going to take my blender by beautify by amna and i'm just going to blend it all out so guys uh, this is how i have to do it i do not like to blend using a brush because i don't find it to be that flawless after that uh, once we're done we're going to be taking this makeup revolution concealer in the shade c6 and you guys know where i like to apply my under my eyes my nose my forehead my chin and you know upper lips after that, I'm just going to blend all of this out using my uh, blender again, the same blender that I used before by Beautify by Amna. And once all of that is done, we're going to move on to this beautiful highlighter. The reason that I'm applying a highlighter right now before everything is because this is a cream uh, highlighter. This is by Zayfide. It's called Chand. And you guys see that glow? It's like amazing. And I like to blend it out using my blender once again. Then we're taking this Huda Beauty setting powder and I'm going to be, you know, baking up everything, my under eye area and uh, my forehead. Uh, not going to be doing the under contour area yet, but then I'm taking this uh, Gerard Cosmetics uh, 
palette and I'm gonna be bronzing up my face using the shade forever after that I'm gonna take that easy bake by Huda Beauty again and just uh, add a little bit of that powder under my cheekbones then I'm going in with this Mac blush which is uh, in the shade eternal Sun it's a beautiful shade guys and I'm gonna be applying that on the on my cheeks and then removing all the excess powder that I have on my face after that I'm taking this Huda Beauty setting spray and applying it on my face and to set everything in its place after that I'm gonna go in with this highlighter this is by Ofra the Everthrough highlighter which was in collaboration with Nikki Tutorials and see that glow guys it's amazing I love this highlighter like amazing next we're gonna take this lip liner by Gerard Cosmetics in the shade Night Shift lip liners by Gerard Cosmetics are the best like the best this is a really dark shade so once I've done this, I'm going to be taking this Honeymoon uh, Lipstick. This is their Liquid Matte, again by Gerard Cosmetics. And I'm just going to blend everything out and for that perfect pout, but a little nudey pout. You guys see that? Then we're taking this uh, Lip Topper by TT Cosmetics, which is a Pakistani brand. And this is in the shade Fairy Lights. And I'm just applying it on top of the lipstick that I applied earlier. And my pout is ready. Actually, my whole look is almost done. I'm just left with my lashes. And for my lashes, I'm going in with the Style Bonjour by Beautify by Amna. And this is the final look. Da -da -da -da. Okay, guys. So this was the final look. Hope you guys enjoyed this. So from my Eid series, this is my Eid look number one. Hope you guys liked it. I tried to dress up as well a little bit. Jewelry, I am not wearing Um for the complete look, you guys can, you know, head over to my Instagram. I will be posting a picture over there. Complete look ki. Or uske lava ye ke mehndi shandi saath laga ke it will look so pretty. Chulri chulri saath apne aap pair up kar le. This one goes with black clothes, brown, orange, maroon. Um, is tarah ke jo colors hote hain. Us is color scheme ke usme yellows, usme ye aapko bronze, gold. Is type ke jo colors hain. Is tarah ye different kapron ke saath aap jo hai na look ko complement kar sakte ho. You can go for bold lips if you want, or you can make them even more nude. Or yeah, that's it. So hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, do not forget to hit like, subscribe, do leave a comment below, or uske lava ye ke do turn on the bell icon so you are notified every time I post a video. So hope you guys enjoyed this. Take care of yourself. I will see you in the next video very soon. Love you. Hello, office.